Hello and welcome to September's Diabetes Technology Report. Wow, what a month it's been. In this month's video, we talk everything EASD, Dexcom G6 in Canada, um, Novo Nordisk's partnership with Medtronic, drones delivering insulin and glucagon in Ireland, a Synovis partnership with Abbott and Freestyle Libre, and a lot more. Diabetes technology. Artificial pancreas, implantable CGMs, insulin pens, clothes, Systems. We are not waiting. Okay, so let's talk everything EASD. I was there. Full vlog will be out in probably about two weeks, so stay tuned for that. It is fair to say that CGMs and smart pens have absolutely dominated this year's EASD with two major announcements. Novo Nordisk announced a partnership with Medtronic to integrate insulin dosing data from Novo's connected pens into Medtronic's CGMs, such as Guardian Connect system. The Guardian Connect system will be updated so smart pens such as Novo Pen 6 and Echo Plus can connect directly to the app, allowing insulin data to be stored on the Guardian app. Medtronic joins Novo's long list of data partners. Also, Sanofi uh, signed a similar partnership with Abbott, manufacturers of the Freestyle Libre system. Data from Sanofi's future smart pen will be integrated with the Freestyle Libre system and vice versa. Sanofi is currently working on smart pens which should be out on the global market within the next few years. Speaking broadly about smart pens, I absolutely love them and I will soon make a dedicated video explaining what they actually do and how they work, similar to my accuracy of measuring glucose video, so stay tuned for that as well. More news from EASD, Medtronic announced a brand new disposable Pro CGM with no calibration. It is fully disposable and it is a professional CGM, so it does not show any values to you. It sends them to the cloud so your healthcare professional can see them. This is sometimes referred as a blind CGM because it doesn't show values to you and blind CGMs are often used when um, newly diagnosed or when new therapy is implemented. So healthcare professional can see the data uh, and see how everything is happening without you seeing it. Also during these, the OneDrop announced a global commercial partnership with Bayer. Bayer will utilize OneDrop's platform in global digital efforts in areas such as cardiovascular disease, women health and beyond. Now some Dexcom news. Dexcom G6 is now available in Canada. It was approved by Health Canada earlier this year and it is now available to buy or through your insurance. All the information you want about Dexcom in Canada is on Michelle's channel. I'm going to put her links down below. Um, she has been using it and so all the info go to her channel for all the details, links down below. One more news from uh, Canada, Freestyle Libre is now reimbursed in two largest provinces in Canada. Next up, Omnipod. Omnipod has now been approved by the FDA and it is now uh, an ACE pump, it has an ACE classification. So um, this is all to do with plug and play, so you can plug in your pump. This is not an Omnipod, by the way. I mean, it, it's meant to look like that, but it's not a real size Omnipod. Um, major step forward in journey to interoperability. As a podder, I'm really excited about that. If you want more information about plug and play and ACE pump and what that means, I'm gonna put some really good articles down below. Our packers are also very happy about that. Now, some news that is literally out of this world. First, diabetes drone has delivered insulin and glucagon in Ireland. This is a collaboration between Vodafone, Novo Nordisk, Sky Tango, and other drone partners. This drone delivered insulin by Novo Nordisk and glucagon from mainland Ireland to Aran Island. Operation received full authorization from the Irish Aviation Authority to show the possibility of future deliveries of insulin and glucagon. This technology will be absolutely groundbreaking as it will allow incredibly quick delivery of medications to remote geographical locations and in times of natural disasters. Huge congratulations to the entire Diabetes Drone team. Uh, this is really one of those projects which is just a collaboration between so many different people. So huge congrats. Also, this drone, uh, the Diabetes Drone, is actually on Twitter already. Uh, it's at Diabetes Drone. And uh, at the time of making this video, this drone has 19 followers on Twitter, 
So please send it some love because I think it's so cool and if you think it's cool as well, please uh, give this drone a follow. And so that's it. Wow, what a month it's been. Uh, September is always very, very exciting in the tech world, in the technology world. Um, obviously we have uh, EASD, which is just so much happens in the, at EASD. Um, we have the Apple event, so like new iPhones, new Apple Watches. Um, it's my uh, YouTube anniversary, so I'm turning two this September, which is kind of crazy if you think about it, that I've been doing YouTube for two years. Um, and I was born in September, <laughs> so it's my birthday as well. So like September is always very, very cool. So please let me know what's your favorite announcement this month. Uh, for me, it has to be the Smart Pen and uh, Diabetes Drone. I just love that thing. I think it's just so cool. Uh, so let me know down below and I see you in about two weeks um, in my EASD vlog. Uh, take care and uh, have a good October. Take care. Bye-bye. Time for our daily lift situation report. Lift is here. This thing. There you go. Oh, hello.